presume someone's a shaheed um, but can you make dua that Allah accept them as a shaheed? Yeah, yeah, sure. There's a subtitle in Sahih al Bukhari titled as Bab la yuqalu fulan un shaheed. None should be saying this so and so is shaheed. And he put under beneath this subtitle many hadith to prove that. But if you say, for example, I, I don't like even a shahidu bi idnillah, it is not. It is, inshallah, it's not a big problem. But still, as if, as if you want to claim something, but bi idnillah. Shaheed if, uh, if Allah will. Now, what if I say I'm Prophet if Allah will? <laughs> Come on. You see? So we say. Allahumma Allahumma rizqhu shahad Allahumma ja'alha lahu shahada That's enough, yeah. Oh Allah, let it be a matter of shahada for him. That's good. No, he must be shaheed. Bithnillah. <laughs> so, that, does this answer the question? Yeah. Like, for example, saying, Marhum. Tuffiya ila rahm, taqala ila rahmatillah. This person had been shifted to the mercy of Allah. We hope, but who told you? Claiming something by Allah without knowledge? No, but I mean, <laughs> um, if in some countries, if, if you ask them what is the greatest crime, not paying the taxes. This is a great crime. Uh, sex, same sex marriage? No, that's normal. Uh, anything, you know, stealing is bad. But not paying the tax is, in uh, the the government doesn't forgive that tax is not paid, but they forgive beyond that to whom they will. Astaghfirullah This is, yani, this is the, so so to us the greatest sin is to talk about Allah without knowledge. Allah say. My Lord had forbade fawahish, abomination. Ma zahara minha wa ma batan. What is apparent, what is hidden. Wal ithma wal baghya bi ghayr al haq. That's the second, that's the highest stage. Highest, higher stage. Wal ithm, and sin. Wal baghya, transgression, a part of truth. Wa an tushriku billahi ma lam yinazil bihi sultana. And that you set apart his with Allah in which he did not allow. وَأَن تَقُولُوا عَلَى اللَّهِ مَا لَا تَعْلَمُونَ And that you say about Allah what you have no knowledge. So, no one should say this is shaheed. This is not allowed. The Sahaba considered some people to be shaheed, and they were wrong. They said about a man, هَنِي أَنْ لَهُ الشَّهَادَ When he died, the Prophet said, كَلَّا He said, no, I swear by Allah. The abaya that he stolen, he mugged, and he did not steal, by the way. But this, this is one of the spoils. He just picked it up and took it for himself, and it belongs to kafar. In the war, you're not allowed to take anything for you, unless it will be collected and given to the leader. Then the leader will be distributing it. But to take it by yourself like this, so the prophet said, no. I swear by Allah that this abaya that he had taken, it's now f flaming him in his grave. Flaming him in his grave. And a man was fighting bravely, and the Prophet said he is one of the people of the fire. And this man was traced until they found him injured, and he could not bear the injury, and he could not bear the injury, he killed himself. That's why it's really dangerous that you show off. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala may cause you a bad end of your life when you show off. This man was showing off. Look how it ended with him. So be, be careful. Dealing with Allah is not an easy matter. Does this answer the question? Barakallah feekum.